So obviously that was a result that slips us down to the third position in the league. Um, how have the squad reacted um, from that loss? Um, obviously everyone's disappointed um, from, from a team point of view and, and a few few individuals, are really, including myself, are really disappointed in, um, in how the result uh, went. But I think we'll learn from that moving forward, as Finney also said, that, um, that the automatic promotion's out, out, of the, out of the picture now, so we're going to have to play off for it. And I think we'll learn from a game like that and, and move forward and, and make the adjustments to hopefully still gain that promotion. And we face Coventry Bears this Sunday, a team that you previously played for and actually beat Newcastle Thunder with yeah. in the uh, second round of the season. Uh, is there anything in particular we need to look out for? Yeah, well, Coventry are a young, enthusiastic side that, that like to uh, capitalise on other teams' errors. Um, I've experienced it firsthand. Like you said, I played down there for the first half of the season. So uh, we need to be really wary of that if, um, if we do make mistakes and a side like Coventry will make us pay. So. Just need to be on top of that and, and completed a high a high rate and um, hopefully the points will come our way. So, and we've now been with Thunder for two months now. And um, since the move from the Bears, how are you finding life in Newcastle? Yeah, life lifestyle um, in Newcastle is quite enjoyable. Um, starting to get know my way around the, the local area and, and the city and that, which is which is good and it helps having um, other Australians like Joel and, and Maddie that was here and Khan and then around to to pop along and and venture into little little high streets and that and get to know the area, so yeah, it's good. Um, Thunder only have three regular season games left in the season, um, and then, like you say, we're gonna enter the playoffs. Um, what can the Thunder family expect to see from Newcastle Thunder in those final exciting games? Yeah, well, um, obviously the short-term goal is to finish off the season season strong with the last three games, um, with, a, with a bounce back from what happened on the weekend. Um, and then, an old coach of mine always said it, once you enter a playoffs, playoff series or a semi-finals format, the, the competition starts again and ideally it does. So um, I'm sure if we do get to the playoffs um, in the position that we need to be, we'll reset and, and, and go, go forward with a bang uh, with some goals in, in mind. So 